A double murder suicide leaving a community on edge. Tonight, friends and the two men killed telling News for Jax they were good, down to earth people who didn't deserve to die. Two others were critically injured in that shooting that happened around 3 a.m. this morning on Bryan Lakes Drive, just off of Normandy Boulevard. Three men were found dead inside the house. One of them believed to be the shooter. Police have identified that man as 26-year-old Jacoby King. The deceased victims are 33-year-old Ryan Chesser and 32-year-old Eric Bryant. Police say the shooter and Chesser were in a relationship at one point. News for Jack's reporter Dusty McKeever is live from the scene where police are still working to learn about what led up to this. Dusty. Denise, this is very puzzling to everyone involved, including those who even knew the shooter. Now, friends I talked to who were friends of the deceased victims, they say they were very nice people from Charleston County, did not deserve this. And so police are relying on those two people alive to tell them what happened. Three people are dead and two are severely injured in what police believe to be a murder-suicide. Before the two injured victims were taken to the hospital, one of them told police 26-year-old Jacoby King shot them. Police say King followed the victims home last night and ambushed the group. Tonight, people from Folkestone are sharing condolences on Facebook. Georgia is where the deceased victims, Eric Bryant and Ryan Chesser, grew up. They were literally the town's sweethearts. Everybody in the town loved them and knew them. And it's, it's, it's going to be a great loss without them. We spoke with neighbors hours after the shooting. Many of them shocked that this happened in their quiet community. Police say Ryan Chesser and the suspect, Jacoby King, were dating at one point, but not at the time of the shooting. It don't happen. It don't happen out here anyway. I know it happens, but no, we don't, you, you don't see it. You don't even see fighting out here, you know, loud talking or None of that out here. So it's, it's shocking to hear that, you know. Um, I, don't, I don't know the family personally. Tonight, people who knew Chesser and Bryant are saying they will be remembered as great men, especially by those in Charlton County. What kind of people were they? They were very good, down-to-earth people, people who would help you in any way they can, if they can at all. The two surviving victims have not been identified. And if you know what led to this shooting, you're urged to call police immediately. Reporting live from the West Side, I'm Destiny McKeever, Channel 4, The Local Station.